Welcome back to Gravity Circuit. We have beaten up at this point... What, three? three? It's three of them. Wow, it feels like I've been playing this game for ages. Well, yeah, the, the levels are chunky. Okay, so last time we beat up Samurai Man, so now we're going to take yep, on... Crash. Um, I don't have a dumb name for him. Uh, they they are a hacker. Look, yeah, I was gonna say, looks like a mad scientist. Hacker man. <laughs> Perfect, hacker man. Let's go. Hash. You know, now that I think about it, are they just named that because of hashtag? Maybe. I mean, who knows though? They all have like computer related names. Well, Crash and Hash were put in the same thing. And Ray and Trace were put in the same thing. Like a Ray Tracer. Hmm. The cyberspace. I know, it kind of sounds like an old person when they say, like, the internet or the yeah. YouTube. Especially they say, like, a website, like, the Googles or the YouTube. The YouTube. Or the OnlyFans. Why do you know about OnlyFans? Everyone knows about OnlyFans at this point. <laughs> Nobody wants anyone snooping through their files. They want them to see all those pervy pictures you got on there. <laughs> the OnlyFans places you've been to. Now, in this universe, it actually be fans. Because you got OnlyFans is a bunch of desk fans. Oh well, you have to. They have. They're robots. They have to have cool ways to cool themselves off. Ridiculously human robots. <laughs> Hacker Man. Oh, he's got them four arms. Cipher Circuit. Hey, this doesn't look like cyberspace. It reminds me of Blast Horn stage. I, you know what? Honestly, I thought you were going to say, what's a Blast Hornet? You're like, we'll, we'll, we'll get to that eventually. Haha, <laughs> took out your shield. <laughs> what you going to do now? Oh, he's shooting at me. No, give me... Give me the guy! <laughs> uh, am I missing anything yet? No. Ooh, I like this warehouse look with, like, the lights fading off into the distance and the racks going up real high. Yeah, I, I tell you, that they the people who worked on this game made a really beautiful-looking game. Like, there's a reason I want... There's, there's two reasons I wanted to rush into doing this one. Mega Man, and it's just a really good-looking game. Like, Oh, you, there's the cyberspace. Like, what do you want me to say? It's just really good-looking... The character animation's great. Yeah, like, there's an absurd amount of love and care that went into this. And passion. Oh, no, you gotta immediately go left, my good sir. Oh, yeah, but there's a guy over here. Okay, good, there's... Ground. Like how we go from, from like, Blast Hornet into, ah. into, like, immediately Cyber Peacock. I guess I kind of just have to get hit by those. You can break them. Well, I tried, and it didn't work. Oh, no, the things that are shooting at you. Oh. The lasers are just, like, a security system, and you're just tripping them. That's why they're active. Oh, they shot shapes at me. Yes, it did shoot shapes at you. Next, it will shoot shapes at you. Get your friggin' Magikoopa butt out of here. What shapes did the Magic Koopa shoot out at you? These. Like, do you... Was it... It's like triangle, circle, square. Is that like a weird PlayStation jab now that I think about it? I don't think so. It's a Super Nintendo game. Well, no, no, not not in that sense. Was PlayStation... Did they take 
when they made the symbols for the controller. I know the guy specifically used the symbols for the controller to mean something. Like the circle and the the X were... Well, the X was confirmation, because Japan's confirmation is the X. And the, the no is the circle for them. And that still throws me off, because every game you play is different. Yeah, every game... Ha it's, it's weird for us, because we never change that. And how... And the, like... Square was supposed to be for map, and triangle was supposed to be for, like, menu. Hate this. It is very annoying. Uh, but no, now that I think about it, did, I know he said that, but is it also, like, a, just because, like, Sony was originally working on, like, the Super... Come on, I can hit it through the spikes. Like, the Nintendo PlayStation... And then they got the thing like, nah, we're not doing it anymore. So they went like, all right, we're stealing the shapes from the Magic Koopa. I doubt it. Don't Wait, go yet. Do I go up or right? You know what's up there. Yeah, I gotta turn on the juice. There we go. I mean, I doubt it too, just because it seems like such a far-fetched thing. But you never know how far pettiness goes in these industries. Sometimes Why so would I need to turn this? Oh, because it blocks off the whole section. That's true. Otherwise, if I went down, I couldn't go back. Because I wouldn't have a means of hitting that one. Yeah, you just have to go back up and then turn it back off. Now I want to go up here. There's nothing. I. You literally can't do anything. Not gonna give me that one. Honestly, at least you're thinking outside the box. I also feel like I should, like, hit a switch and then backtrack to here and go up the left here. It really should, but I don't think there's nothing up there, so... Okay, so I don't like this one at all. Oh, that wasn't so bad. This one. Okay, this one's great, because it, I hate it, because it took me forever to realize there's a thing here. Now go back. And go down. Ah. Yep, I kept, clever. I kept missing this one, because I was just like, where is it at? And then I looked at it, and I was like, oh, because I'd never turned the thing because I never realized the spikes turn off. Yeah. Because I immediately went up and the spikes left my field of vision and I was like, all right, those spikes don't exist anymore. You punched his shield back into him, therefore making him easier to kill. No, but I want to see... Can I, like, just gently set him down on the ground so I, I can hit this switch? Uh, I think you can kind of throw him and he may bounce back to be caught, but once he goes red like that, it's kind of fun. You'd have to have thrown him. Yeah, I'm, gonna you, I'm gonna need you to shoot to the left. No, back. No, I still want to throw in things. Saw that coming. They, those things do drop a chip too, by the way. Kind of like the bats, though. They're annoying to kill. Yeah, because when they when you can hit them, they're shooting at you. Well, I think I was gonna say more of the fact that it's like they take two shots. Oh, cool. gotcha. Uh oh, looks like you're gonna have to jump. Tonight is all right for tonight. Still gotta do that game series at some point. Yeah. We'll get... Somebody gifted that to me, actually. Oh, neat. We do need to do more of those old Dang it. adventure games. I just don't know which ones I care to do. Like, I feel like a King's Quest and Space Quest one's got enough stuff from other more bigger name characters, so.
I feel like Space Quest is kind of a must, though. I, I mean, either or, I'm fine with. I kind of like both of those series. Okay, so you're up there. Hey, thanks. Okay, so they just fire once when you... Yeah, it's just the security. It's like that... They're not, like, on alert suddenly. Yeah, they're just like, oh, same trip security, shoot it. Okay, I guess it's done. I really want to get over there, but you're being kind of pain in the Shooting the PlayStation symbols everywhere, and I'm just not appreciative of it right now. It reminds me too much of Dragon Song Reprisal. Do you know PlayStation actually kind of had, like, a, a, a joke post when they saw that? Hmm. A joke tweet, because they saw, like, somebody post a strategy and everybody had the symbols go over their heads. Hmm. And PlayStation goes like, hmm. And I'm like, I can't guarantee that they didn't do that on purpose, but at the same time, it seems like something that team would do on purpose. Every time I grab a guy, there's nobody around to chuck him at. <laughs> Why can't I throw more people at things? Oh, 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 don't go in yet. Go yeah, back. I can see the thing on the other side, so there's clearly something over there. Yeah, go back. You see it now? Gap. The big old gap. I like, this, I like how it tells it like tells you without telling you because it's like there's a thing there but how do I get that thing? Whoa. And then you kind of have to go like well these spikes all over the place. Honestly you can kind of sneak over it but you have to be really good with the like hook shot to get over it. Hey. Oh and that's for the juice. More burst energy. More burst juice. Nice! Haha. <laughs> It's funny because you fell for it. Cool! <laughs> I was kind of hoping you'd smack the thing open, but hey, you made it. Uh, so did I! Okay, so now for each of these portals, there is one person in there. So, we have to, so it's a re-boss fight. We're gonna fight all the robot masters again. We're not there. We're not there yet. And we can fight finally. Is there? I think, yeah, I think there's one per. Because we've already gotten two of them? Three. Three of them. Okay, yeah, so there's four in here, so that's seven. So we got one more to go after this. Don't like this. He was in the spikes when you hit it, so he crashed. There's something weird about having the virus army in the vi in an actual cyberspace. Like, something about it seems right, but also, like, weird. It's like we're really playing Battle Network again. <laughs> Except we've moved on to the second game, so we're not hurting physically anymore. <laughs> Or at least falling. Did you feel tired at any point during that game? No, actually. No. Weirdly, like, other than that, as I said, it genuinely hurt my soul in several places. Um, other than that, I felt I felt good the whole time. I genuinely enjoyed the game. Ugh, okay. Okay, so I can hand you. So we're literally at points where I felt like when I was playing through my file, I could fall asleep during the whole thing. Uh, and I was like, I don't know if this is a good idea. This is like a good thing to say for this game. I haven't tried the second game yet, but I'm trying to get into other okay, games. Okay, just save too. the guy. So Yeah, you save the guy. I did the thing. I thought that Story of Seasons, A Wonderful Life, and I've just been begging to try to play it with myself, and my brain goes like, how about you stay on TV Tropes for another day? Oh, I don't like this. Oh yeah, controls are reversed. Okay, so left is still left. Yeah, but up is down and black is white and everything you know is wrong. Okay, camera doesn't go any further to the left.
Oh yeah, and we discovered like everything that has eyes just goes googly eyes when you punch them enough. And they go like, what? And it's great. Just like utterly shocked, I'm like, wait, I'm dying now? <laughs> oh, what the crap? I want that. I got that. I should be paying more attention to what chips I have equipped. What do I have? Range of regular attacks. A lot of spikes, but I haven't really been falling into them. You've actually been pretty good about that. And I actually have pretty good health right now, too, so I'm not too worried about that. Yeah, this ah, there it is. Yeah, this one's pretty easy to figure out. <laughs> okay, well, so much for not falling into the spikes. Up is down, down is up! <laughs> Black is white, up is down, and short is long. <laughs> Even they're upside down. I'm like, wait a minute, something doesn't feel right. Wait, you can duck those even from there? Apparently. That is weird. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna say I purposely did that. <laughs> Everything exactly is planned. So it may not have been entirely obvious, but when I said up is down, down is up, I was trying to jump and then press up to hook shot to the ceiling to move myself up. Hmm. Um, but instead of up, I pressed down, which made me slide, which is why I shot off into the spikes. <sighs> How long have I can keep my stomach in there? I don't really care what you do. I don't think you have to worry about that as a robot. Oh dear! Yeah, this one gets a little confusing. Hey, I got I, the chip. Yeah, I got the chip. And you, and you blew up the security. Okay. Cool. Man, I wanna. I get it. I got to. Not that I really needed to, because it just sent me back down here. Perfect. Exactly his plan. This is how the gravity circuit works, and there is no one who can deny that. I did get the first one. Yes, you did. I was desperately looking around like, he's at the end, right? Right? Okay, we're starting to hurt a little bit. So I'm gonna swap you out for the old energy absorber. Yeah, you go that way. No ground under that one.
No ground under that one. I don't like the pressure that the cannon being right there puts on you. They fire three bullets, which makes it kind of hard to dodge them in a small area. So you're kind of forced to keep moving, but then you don't have time to even look at what's ahead and see, like, is the invisible platform going to appear below me? Or do I have to hook shot off the ceiling? Well, I mean, you can tell that's progress, so... Obviously, that means you have to keep going past this section. Perfect. Well, you saved her. I did it! Oh, that puts me back here. Oh. You were- you completed it. <laughs> okay. So, essentially all you did was you died after you picked up the robot, so... I'm a winner! Okay, should be one more, hopefully. Can you sneak past it? How dare you understand you can sneak past it. Oh, wait! I don't see anything over there. Hold up. You would think that would be make sure you don't, or something. Make sure you don't go in. Okay. Try kicking down on that purple section. Nope. No. There. Go back. Kick one of these sections. I swear there's a... Because it's like at the beginning where... One of the sections is like... Where that, like, that thing is telling you that there's a section you can kick into. Because I remember this one getting me for a while. I'm not seeing anything. Did you kick down on that big purple one? You can, you can you can hook co uh, hook shot across. Yeah, I, mean, I know you got room, so. Hit the floor here. Mm, it's sighting. I know there's one, and it's kind of one of those weird ones. But if it's not popping, it's not popping. Find it eventually, I'm sure. Oh, right there. Last one. Hey! Thank you. Why do they all sound like Beetle? Because I have one frame of reference for people saying thank you in video games. <laughs> And that's the pre-boss checkpoint. Yeah, I'm trying to remember why they give it to you, because usually when they give you a checkpoint, it's not a good sign. Uh, I think I'm alright with what I got for now. Oh, yep, this is it's clicking already. I went the wrong way. Yes, you did. Hey! Well, you grabbed his bullet and threw it back at him. So in the end, you were a winner. I don't like this. Okay. Oh, it made the spikes go away. So all as well. Immediately conquered it, therefore I'm the best. Why didn't you trigger it? because they're not intruders. That did not go as smoothly as it went in my head. Oh, 
hook shot. Yeah, I'm just thinking. About stuff and things. Yeah. How you wish Leah Sargent would come back and voice things. Yeah. Did you know that that Trigun reboot didn't have Millie in it? Yeah. That's a weird choice to make, I, honestly. I really thought she was going to show up in, like, later episodes or something, but apparently never did. She's in the manga, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, I just want to make sure. Is it, isn't it, like, a truncation of the reboot? No, the reboot is brand new. It's not manga or anything. Okay. Like, they, it's a it's a reimagining is what it is. Ah, okay. And they reimagine Millie out? Can it really truly be called Trigun, then? Really? Did they give Wolfwood his manga interpretation, or did they do a new one for I him? I think they did the manga. Mm. Oh, what was the guy who replaced Wolfwood in the manga? Oh, I don't know. I do not remember his name. He was one of the gung ho guns. Yeah. Like hey, the... rude. I liked him. He was pretty cool. Yeah. Jeez! <laughs> That's that's funny. All the money still trying yeah, to find all the its money way just, to me. All the money being pulled into you like gravity. <gasps> oh man, he's back. Oh bull crap. <laughs> Did you watch the Trigun series? Cuz like didn't they destroy like one of the biggest organizations in the world? Yeah, they the kind galaxy. of um I don't know if there's a lot of places to go from where they were. Okay, well, no. They, they like, broke up one branch of it, didn't it? It's like no. A, wait, the whole thing that was the big. That was the big man. I thought he had... I thought he had people above him. Um, if... I think there may have been people above him, but it was very... You kind of got the impression that the guy that they took... It, that it was just, like, organized crime... So to say, and the guy that they took out yep. was the one with, like, delusions of... Granger? Megalomania. Huh. So, like, yeah, he had people above him, but, like, not, like, a bigger bad above him. Checkpoint. Oh, yeah, no, there's the Tendo King above him. Yeah. There's, like, again, there were... He's, yeah, he's the Tempa Emperor, but... Oh. No. no, wait, there's a... T Hold up, who is the... Who, the bad guy was the Tendo King. No, wait, they never showed up. Oh, it was Hanzo... Han Hanzoko? How do you pronounce that? Mm. Hanzonko? Trying to... Hazanko. Hazanko. Oh, yeah, Hazanko. Yeah, he's got the Tendo King and the Tempa Emperor above him. But at that point, does... Do they really need to clash with him? Because Hazanko was the only one who wanted... Because the... What was her name? I literally have it up here. Uh, Melfina was, like, their key to the ley lines. Yeah. And, like, after that, there's, like, no implication that the, the Emperor and the King wanted anything to do with anything else. Yeah. Uh, okay, I think I'm ready to... I think I'm ready to murder. I don't know if I can put anything else on to replace this that would be better for bosses. I guess I had to put uh, stage hazards on. Where's the stuff? Stage oh, hazard. Oh man, I remember he was. I liked him. He was a great one. Shima. Yeah. Yeah, the first the Anton Seven. Like he was just kind of a regular guy. He, he wasn't was, like he was all just, mystical and weird. He's just. He was just there to do his thing. All right, what do you got for me, nerd? Hey, there's a computer inside this computer. <laughs> what are the odds? Well, I just noticed your symbol in the background of the computer, too. Tracking me. I thought he said tapes for a minute. <laughs> Work so hard on those tapes! They work on hard of those tapes.
Underclocked isn't the best insult, because that implies that you can raise your clock speed. You just haven't. Is there a neutral setting for that whole thing? Because there's underclocked, there's overclocked. Is it just clocked? I don't know if there's a word for it. It's just setting your clock speed to what it's supposed to be. Mm, I'm just asking. All right. Well, um, punching in the face has worked up until now. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you gotta remember you can do that whole. Yeah, this is gonna hurt, but that's fine. Okay, that's an actual achievement you can get. Oh, I don't like that! Is that if you punch him while he's laughing at you, you get an achievement for it, which uh. I, I actually already got. It only counts if his clones hit you, he starts laughing at you. Almost. Hey, I tried. Yeah, it was half the reason I wanted you to get used to that. As quick as you could. He just stood... Oh, that's <laughs> crap. How did that still count? Jerk! Oh, and I punched him off the edge so he had to teleport back. Yeah, this is the first one you beat, I think, without having to restart. He just stood there and let me punch him a lot. Well, Like, he had a couple moves, but... Yeah, he teleports around the room, but as long as you follow him and go to the last one, that none of his clones are a threat. Is his collar a satellite dish? That is actually really smart. Because his, his neck, it looks like it's a satellite yeah. dish and everything. God, I love these character designs. Even <laughs> the more I look at them, the more I'm like, yeah, I like soon. this. Soon. Very soon. Yeah, so, like, his teleporting wasn't a huge threat. As long as you just got to him and punched him, he didn't do anything worth a darn. Oh, and he has to have his asymmetrical as well. <laughs> his little... His, like, summoning of the whole area and leaving the opening space got me the first time. After that... I mean, I got hit after that, but after that, it was my fault when I got hit. Because I'm just not paying attention. Oh, wait, did you see your damage taken? Sloppy! Thank you. <laughs> it did. It was you or me. Though I, I hate... got all the mans. I hate to say it, though. Your pronunciation there was pretty sloppy. Yeah, it wasn't great. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've heard it. For all amigo! I'm not great at... Voices? Uh-oh. I'm not great at certain voices. There's, like, a choice few I could do real well. But, like, mo I think your average voice, I'm not great at. Somebody plug him in. <laughs> Turn him off and on. <laughs> oh, right. I wanted to ask you, do you know what a kernel in a computer... I think. Is it do you know what a kernel in a computer is? Um, like, does it refer to something specific, or is it just, like, a generic term for certain Oh, it parts? refers to something specific. Um, I forget exactly what it is, though. Uh, oh. I think it's software, though. It's not hardware. Is it? Oh, my God. I thought it was hardware. I thought it was, like, a chip or something. No. I think it's software-related. And it's, like... It's, like, the... Is it spelled, like, kernel? Yeah, it's here? spelled like this. Okay. Uh, I can't remember exactly, though. I I'm gonna look I think it it's, like, the, op the core of an operating system, I guess. Oh, yeah. Kernel... Oh, it literally says... That kernel operating system. The kernel is a computer program at the core of computer's operate, operating system and generally has complete control over everything in the system. Oh, oh so that's, yeah. You so, go 10, 15 year old computer science degree. Oh, so that explains why he's in control of everything, because he's the kernel of the whole Guardian oh, you know, that Corps. that does make sense. Yeah, that that's... I hate how smart this is. <laughs> because it makes me feel stupid, but at the same time I learn something. <laughs> Can I get What are you keeping on there that you don't want people to see, Colonel? Hold up. Who are the people who made this? Yep, right over there, all non symmetric. Gravity. I got nothing 
Two. Have a new. Ah, it doesn't have a Wikipedia page yet. That stinks. Um. I have the TV Tropes page open, so I can just check there. Okay, so you sell stuff. First thing we gotta do is talk to everybody. See if they say new things. See if they say anything new. Yeah, it's domesticated ant games. Because, like, can, can, can we get a little figure of Kai? I'd love a little figure oh, of Kai. Oh, that'd be neat. Especially if you had, like, little face plates you can change out so you can get the, like, exasperated, like, ugh, so you can uh, face palm him properly. Yeah. I don't know, I just like Kai's design. It's got that... It's neat. It's got that basic Mega Man, oh, Mega yeah. Man X, Zero kind of thing where it's, like, it's busy, but normal enough that you... It's, like... Yeah, it's busy, but not overly busy. Yeah, it's like, there's not a lot of noise to it, whole thing, so it's not distracting, but it's enough that you go, like, oh, I can see where his design is at and yeah, everything. Yeah, like, nothing feels like it's there arbitrarily. Like, they just added detail for the sake of adding detail. Yeah, it's just all, like... Like, it's all, it's all there on purpose. And they made him specifically red to make him pop out of everything. And I like that he's kind of, I want to say wide, but like, he's like squat, almost. Yeah. And that's, the, I mean, that's the design, and that's how you make it to fit this, but having that kind of like high mobility design, but also be kind of like squarish like that, it just looks neat. Yeah. And then you, when you see him like in the actual character portraits, he's like, properly proportioned and everything yeah. so it's like you know how it works it's that final fantasy 7 thing yeah where like on map they're like chibi characters but then in battle they're proportioned correctly yeah Nerd. um i just killed hash i'm sorry murdered the crap out of him so in case you're wondering why they're using books, this is why. <laughs> books, as he calls them. Ooh. Anybody always... else new? Before oh. I start talking to vendors. I always gotta remember those chips. figure out how. I'm sure people have screamed at me in the comments about it like four videos ago, but here we are. Uh, they probably have, but it's also because I think I mentioned I got the achievement, so it might be one of those things where it blocked you out from getting it again. Okay, what new stuff do we got? Ah, Bazooka Joe. Virus Cannoneer. Cyber Spike. Normal spiky. Cyber. Cyber. Oh. Yeah, because I did get that one. Energy mortar. That's it for enemies. Bosses. like that's it so we're at least keeping up on our lore oh crap I've been speeding through dialogue I was gonna say it's like remember this is new stuff
knows a lot about the circuits for somebody who doesn't seem to know about the circuits. Yeah, I'm starting to think he may know something. Create trailing clones for short duration that mimic your attacks. I kind of like that one, but I wish I'd gotten more use out of it. Mm. Is that, um... Um... Shinobi? What's the game called? Nin Ninja something? My brain isn't working. Uh... Like, PlayStation? No, NES. Oh, Ninja Gaiden. Ninja Gaiden, yep, there we go. That's Ninja Gaiden crap right there. I, I think, yeah, I think that's basically what it is. The hologram that will detonate after a short time on contact. I, I, I know you couldn't do it. It's effectively just sitting a bomb down. I know you couldn't do it because you didn't think of it properly, but it would have been hilarious if you called it, like, something called, like, Shinobi Side Stories. <laughs> oh, so you mean Ninja Gaiden? Yeah, Shinobi si Side Stories. Was the original arcade called Ninja game called Ninja Gaiden? No idea, probably. Okay, now I got eight mans again. You know, I kind of like that idea, actually. What'd you get? Chain booster. Oh, I like that. Make your hurt to do more. It changes the color, too. I love it. Oh. Okay, now I have three mans. Okay. Yeah, the original game was called Ninja Ryukenden, which means Ninja Dragon Sword Legend. All right, and once again, I'm poor, but we're doing all right. Because I was going to say, it makes sense for, like, the, f the arcade game to not be called Ninja Gaiden and then actually have the first game called Ninja Gaiden as in, like, the side story thing. All right, well, for the time being, I'm swap these out with something a little different. You going to try the hookshot thing? Yeah, let's try Magnet Chassis. Let's try Chain Booster. Let's try... Was this one? Ah, it absorbs that. There's one that gives me my juice back. This is ridiculous. Apparently, there's a compute kernel in his in GP GPU programming. Hmm. I hate how it's called GP GPU programming. Oh, there's something called kernelization, a technique for designing efficient algorithms. Oh, so that's what... Okay, that actually explained. Kernel, a routine that is executed in a vectorized loop, for example, in general purpose computing on graphics processing units. GP, GPU. Graphical processing unit. Alright, until next time... Ooh. It's like gray now. Do you see gray? I see orange. I see... I see gray or purple. I mean, I can see the purple now, but I always got orange out of it. Oh, definitely purple. You sure? I think maybe the tip I could see being orange, but, like, the links are definitely purple. Listen, if your tip is orange, you need to go to the hospital. But it, 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 oh, it, while it. it's flying out, it's definitely purple. Okay, I can see it against the background. It's purple. It changes color when it hits something, though. I could see that being orange, but I feel like it's just a really bright purple. Yeah, I feel like it's all just a really bright purple. Really bright purple? Ah, crap. Oh, you don't have to do anything. I don't know what cancel is. B. Wait. Oh, I actually stay on. Wait. Wait. You do that thing, Sir Kai. <laughs> <laughs> he would say it too. Just hook shot into the room, land next to me, and then does this. <laughs>